we're back with some more reactions. This was my piece for a really close friend of mine named John Zhu. John Zhu loves uh, MF Doom and he loves the shy guy. And uh, I think he wanted this to be green and I made it red. And I think that's why he got me the uh, Enchroma glasses. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just kidding, John. Too. No, he did, he does want it green, but oh, when I when I googled shy guy, it came up with a red one, so I used the red one. <laughs> I've been waiting forever to use that joke. That's so funny. All right, but yeah, we getting into some reactions. Speaking of homies, we're gonna do some hard boys. If you guys don't know who this is, this is uh. Two people from the UK that I just met recently that came out to Vegas and uh I dude, they're so cool. These guys were so dope. But uh they make these videos, they're like <laughs> like they should have a TV show, these two, man. They're they're absolutely hilarious. This is watch this to make a billion pounds a second, and it's not clickbait. Hard boys, masters of business. I have not got to see this yet. Um <laughs> I was about to watch it when it premiered and then I was like, you know what? I'm going to just react to it so you guys can watch it with me. But here we go. Let's see what these guys are doing. They, their humor is very sarcastic and dry and I it just cracks me up and <laughs> I feel like such an idiot sometimes for laughing as hard as I do at it. <laughs> way back. Basically you met through a fish. You sold this fish to gain a profit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, straight from So what? Unfortunately, what's your idea? Please don't open it. We sell these 50p a pop. So we take all the hinges off of people's doors we, and then so sell them. So what we need to do is we need to just go to people's houses, take their hinges and sell them. But we don't want to use these hinges because these hinges don't work. Because Vic, he knows how to make money, but I want to make money. Because I don't know how to make money, but I need money. So you um, use Vic? Yes. In a, but, in a sense? No, he's, he's, he's my friend. Uh, we hear you do some rap. Um, yeah, yeah. Some people said you were the best in uh, Brighton at rapping. I just gotta throw this out there. Me and Vic were supposed to do a song together, but then he's, he's ghosted me completely. So I took him off the track. Someday when I get big and famous and you want to be on a track with me, I'm going to ignore you. But no hard feelings. I love you, man. I won't boast, but... Um... I'm the best in the world. Can you show us some of your raps? I just need to go to the toilet. Hey, but where are you going? I have my hand in many things. I'm a part-time rock star. Part-time entrepreneur, part-time legend, and a part-time all-around great guy. Excuse me. <sighs> so, um, where were we? He said something about something. Nothing to do with raps. We found a fish, and we used the fish in a manner that no one else has thought of, and from this fish, we made 25p. If we make multiple fishes, then we can make multiple 25p's. So when, uh, when we moved over here, we bought, we bought shares in this building. This is the second hotel that I have shares in. And it's my main source of income, about 20 quid. Now actually tell me when you're ready. We roll, we're ready, yeah? Okay, uh, when, when you think of the British seafront, the main food that comes to mind is chicken. 
So we've come up with the idea. We're gonna sell chicken for money. My meat is I don't know why this makes me laugh so hard. <laughs> it's just so like blatantly like sarcastic and it just cracks me up like every little shot that they do standing in front of a fish and chips sign saying that obviously chicken is the most <laughs> my, uh, chicken my chicken <laughs> Camera, that's the sensor. Chicken It's too sketchy. We'll come back. Come too back. sketchy. See, if the thing is, though, we need the chicken to start selling the chicken. The thing is to get the chicken and eat my chicken plug. A lot of people try to get in on the chicken game. We thought we were going to be ahead of the crew. When we got on the chicken game I'll earlier. One chicken. No one gets out of the chicken game. There's two ways out of the chicken game. You die, or you end up as a chicken. No joke. My friend Vinny, they called him Vinny the Rooster. He was on this street selling chicken. No way of a lie. Next day someone comes down, they find a chicken. He's wearing his bandana. Then they, they called him Vinny, Vinny the Rooster still because he was still a chicken, yeah. So his nickname didn't change, he's still Vinny the, Vinny the Chicken. That's why when you get in the chicken game, you got to stay out the chicken game. Me, me and Vinny. Man, you guys got to get a, somebody, donate some money to them, invest in a wind guard. Do they make those for camera mics? I'm sure they do. They got to, right? Made our money just by selling chicken. Get one chicken, 25p. Then if you sell four chicken, you got one pound. And then if you get 20 chicken, you get more than one pound. And eventually it gets to a lot more than one pound. So I've just had a thought. Sometimes uh, me and Vic will come down here to the sea from <laughs> It's so dumb, but it just fucking makes me laugh so hard. <laughs> I've just had a thought. <laughs> So I've just had a thought. Sometimes uh, me and Vic will come down here to the seafront and the best place to think and come up with ideas is down here. Today I've had a lot of trouble walking around because I've sprained my ankle. And of course you're in going turn now. I don't have an in going turn now. I don't. It's got an, it's I don't. I don't have an ingrown toenail. He's got an ingrown toenail. I don't have an ingrown toenail. My toenail's not ingrown. It's outgrown. I don't have an ingrown toenail. You have an ingrown toenail. Bought a percentage in a uh, in this building. It's a big pole. As you can see up there, it goes all the way up and it comes back down. For it's a good investment. Wait, 25p worth of shares. Yep. And because of my shares. I pretty much own this now, so we can get we get free free rides whenever. Oh no! It just ends. <laughs> oh man! Never ceases to amaze me. You guys did a good job. I love it. It's very very funny, man. These guys crack me up. Flackers has a, a really cool vlog about uh, their trip to Canada and San Francisco and in Las Vegas. And uh, yours truly happens to star in it a little bit, me and my family, when we uh, took them out to the desert and uh, taught them how to shoot some guns, some, you know, real American shit. We took them to Bass Pro. Pro Bass Pro? Pro Bass? What the fuck is it? Oh, my God. I'm having like a, maybe I'm having a stroke. Bass Pro? Bass Pro. Bass Pro Shops? Whatever it's called. Oh my god, I don't know why I can't think of it. But yo, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you got at least a little bit of a laugh out of it. Go go follow Flackers. Go follow Vic. Even if he doesn't want to do music with me, he does really, really dope stuff. And uh, thanks for watching. Peace out.